All right, Craigslist find number one. Uh, this is the freebie that I got. So let's uh, let's take a look at it before we turn it on. Uh, these were this particular style of um, power supply was designed by a company called Harrison Laboratories. And Harrison built these nice power supplies. Hewlett Packard decided they wanted to get into the uh, power supply business. So they bought Harrison. So some of the original boxes say Harrison. Uh, some of them say Harrison Hewlett Packard. And then it finally went to an all of all uh, all Hewlett Packard design. This one looks like it's a bit later. It looks like this is an, an all Hewlett Packard design. But since they bought Harrison, I'm sure the engineers were Harrison engineers. Um, so let's uh, let's take a look at this thing. Obviously, there's no connectors on the front. So how do you run this thing? Well, it's kind of, it's kind of meant to be an in in rack type situation. When anyway, all of the uh, uh, connectors are here in the back, uh, you know, plus and minus and and, and and remote sense. These these all had remote sense. Um, but let's uh, let's open it up. Take a look inside. All right, there we go. Wow. Wow. That's a linear supply. I don't want to lose these screws. I put them over there. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Look at that transformer. That is a beauty. Oh my God. That transformer is very expensive. Um, and these caps, these sprayed caps, they're beautiful. All right. Let's, uh, Let's move the camera over a bit. All right, look at this. How big is that transfer? Oh my goodness. Four and a half by four. Four and a half by four by by three. I mean, it's just a giant monster. Uh, wow, <laughs> that is just amazing. And uh, let's see here. We've got a really really big rectifiers. These are monsters also, so must be center tapped. So there's two diodes there. Uh, everything's got some adjustments. Adjustment, adjustment, adjustment. So usually, you know, gain and offset and I don't know if this has, I don't think it has current limiting. I think it's just, it's just volts. That's it. And it just outputs what it can output. Yeah, it does have a power. It does have some type of uh, monitor though for current. If you look on the on this side, there is a uh, oops, my camera tilt here. So there is a big power power resistor over there, 0.1 ohms. It looks like 40 watts. Wow, 40 watts. Yeah, this is a this is a monster. These uh, sprigs are. Uh, 5,600, 5,600 microfarads at 25 volts. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> heavy duty. Looks like the pass transistors are down there, two of them. Uh, they look like different part numbers though. Hmm. So not sure what's going on there. And there's another one down over here, which is uh, interesting. I don't know why there'd be another another one there so oh i said there's two of them i'm sorry camera's in the way i'm not looking at it right so this is the main heat sink in the back here so these must be the pass transistors here and uh, these are the same type yeah so these are the same type so these are probably big ass uh npns and uh not sure what those are over there maybe just drivers for these or something else i'm not sure um, yeah, some expensive resistors here. Yeah, it's designed nice, but there's not much going on. And the circuit looks pretty, pretty simple. So I need to find a schematic for this thing. I, I took one look online. I couldn't, could not find a schematic for this. And, um, I guess I could buy one for $9. Since I got it for free, I guess I can spend $9. I don't know if I really want to or not, but, uh, let me uh, let me search around some more, see if I can't find a schematic for this thing and try to figure out what to do with it. I really don't need five volts at eight amps, but it's a nice linear supply. 
like I said, I might be able to make it adjustable so we can go between zero and um, zero and five volts. Uh, we might be able to measure the transformer and um, instead of using it center tapped at eight amps, we can use it end to end at four amps and get 10 volts out of it. So it might be a nice, uh, a nice project. I have to think about that anyway. I thought I'd show it. Um, this one's going to go off the sh on the shelf for a while, so I won't be working on this for a while, but that's what it is.